baby, it's cold outside. But we're gonna warm things up today with a homemade hot toddy. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I am Carol, the Thrifty Chic Housewife, and I'm so glad that you stopped by. I hope you will consider subscribing, like and share my videos, and follow me on social media. I've left all the links in the description box below my video. So today we're gonna do something fun. We are going to warm things up and we are going to make a hot toddy. Uh, a couple of videos ago, we had canned up some spiced honey and we're gonna be using it today in our homemade hot toddy. Now, if you're not a canner, don't worry. You don't have to be. I will explain to you how you can make a hot toddy just using some spices and some honey um, off the shelf. It doesn't have to be canned, but for those of you who follow me for canning and you can this up, this is a great way to use it. I enjoy the history of food and kind of understanding where it originates. So I thought I would just share a little bit of history with you about the hot toddy. Um, it's actually been around since the 1700s and it was officially written down and defined as a beverage made of alcoholic liquor with hot water, sugar, and spices. Whether you're feeling under the weather or you just want a nice comforting drink, the hot toddy is a great one to go for. You can certainly add your favorite tea to this drink. Now a couple that I had on hand that came to mind that I thought would work really well, you could obviously just use straight up black tea, um, but lemon zinger, it's an herbal tea, it would be great. That would be a great base for it. Honey vanilla chamomile or just plain chamomile would be great. Um, the um, hot toddy would also be great made with chai tea. That's one of my favorites and it uh, chai already has a lot of delicious warm spices to it So it would lend itself well to making this drink. So if you wanted to make it as a tea feel free to steep your um, Hot toddy with a tea bag as well, but for today's purposes, I'm leaving out the tea We're just gonna make a straight-up hot toddy. Okay, so if you are making this without the infused honey that I canned up You're going to need two tablespoons of just regular honey. You're going to need some whole cloves two three four of them um, you're also going to want a cinnamon stick you're going to put all of that in with a lemon slice into your mug or your cup and then you're going to add your hot water about a half a cup of hot water on top of that and you're going to allow it to steep for about five minutes then you can go ahead and add your whiskey give it a stir and it's ready to enjoy those of you who have the spiced honey on hand this is how we're going to make it Okay, so if you are using the infused honey, you're going to take a couple of tablespoons of your infused honey, put it in the bottom of your cup or mug. Add just a little bit more. And again, this is all to taste. Then we're going to add our hot water. We want about a half a cup of hot water. And then we're going to add a shot however much you want. I have about two ounces here of my whiskey. Put that in my cup. Give it a stir. Maybe add a cinnamon stick for some extra flavor. And you are good to go. Okay guys, so what do you think? Really simple, right? It smells amazing. Um, so let's give it a try. See how we did? Wow super yummy. Obviously the first thing that you smell and taste is the whiskey. So that's why it's important to use a good quality one. It's really good. And then you get some of the lemon and then you get the sweetness of the honey. And in the background, you have those wonderful warm spices. Mm -mm. A great way to warm things up on a cold winter's day and a great way to use up the delicious spiced honey that we made. See how pretty that is? If you are not a canner, you can still make the spiced honey and just keep it in your refrigerator so you can have it on hand for a hot toddy on demand. Has everything already in it that you need. You don't have to add anything else. So I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me today and I hope that you'll give this a try. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share and I will see you next time. Cheers.